Thank you for joining me today. My name is Trent Berlinger and I am the chief writer and owner of the site VitaReviews.net. I have been in operation for 17 months and in that time I have contributed over 220 reviews to the PlayStation Vita community. Now I'm not here to talk about my reviews today. I am here to talk about this. If you don't know, this is what you would call the PlayStation TV. Some people call this a Vita in a box, some call it a streaming device. This is a micro console that plugs into your HD TV that will allow you to play Vita and other types of games as well as streaming. Now on the back of this, it has a slot for a memory card for the PS Vita, a USB cord, an HDMI port, and an Ethernet port. And up here, there is a slot to put in retail Vita cartridges. Now a lot of sites think that all the PlayStation TV can do is stream games. While it is true that the PlayStation TV does have access to PlayStation Now to stream PS3 games and remote play to stream games from a PS4, it can do a lot more than that. The PlayStation TV can play retail and digital PlayStation Vita games, such as imports, like the Japanese Fantasy Star Nova or the Asia release of Sword Art Online Hollow Fragment, or it can play localized releases like Persona 4 Golden. Now it can play a lot of digital titles as well, such as digital PSP games, PlayStation 1 games, and PlayStation Mini games. There is a lot it can do, and there's a lot of controversy over the PlayStation TV, especially regarding compatibility. When it released in the West last October, there were a lot of games that it, it did work on, but there were a lot of games that did not work on the PlayStation TV. Now, a lot of people think this compatibility hasn't changed at all since October. However, if you look on my site, on the main header, there is a link that says PlayStation TV Game List. I maintain a constantly updated list for North America and United States users of every single app and game that works on the PlayStation TV, be it a PS Vita game, PlayStation 1 game, or PSP game. Now this is updated several times every week. If you think the compatibility is the same as it was in October, you are dead wrong. Every single week new games come out that are compatible with the PlayStation TV, and new games and older games are updated to work on it. Now this is what we are here to discuss today. What I am about to show you is a visual video presentation of a lot of different types of games that the PlayStation TV can do. Now this is nowhere near the full list of compatible games like is shown in my site's compatibility list, but this is every single PlayStation TV game that I own. From PlayStation Vita games, to PSP games, to PS Minis, to PlayStation 1 games. I hope you enjoy this list and I hope some of these games can pique your interest.
I hope you enjoyed that video presentation. Do note that all of the music that you just heard was taken from games that are in this list. The PS Vita music section was taken from Freedom Wars. The music for the PSP section was taken from Ace Combat Joint Assault. And the music for the rest was taken from Final Fantasy VIII. If you ever have any questions about compatibility issues, the PlayStation TV in general, or even the PS Vita in general, feel free to contact me because I am around most of the time. You can email me at trent at vitareviews.net. You can contact me on Twitter at twitter.com slash vitareviews. Or you can come onto my site or my forum at forum.vitareviews.net. I hope you love this presentation, and I hope this was enlightening for you. Thank you, and have a great day.